So, hello. Hello, everyone. That's Andy. And that's Daz. We're the Beaulieu Brothers. And today we're on a little walk because we've been tagged in a Show Us Your Brew video. Cheers, Karen. Thanks, Karen. After your payback. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, so we'll leave a link to Karen's channel in the description. And before we get on to showing you our brew, we'll have a little nice wander around the area. We're up the bank of the River Coldew at the minute. It's As you can see... It's still kind of cold. There's bits of snow and stuff on the floor. Yeah, still snow on the floor. Snow on the floor. There we go. So yeah, it's pretty chilly. I don't know what the temperature is. It's, I would say it's borderline freezing, yeah? Um, it would have fallen out if it was uh, above freezing, so it's about freezing, isn't it? Yeah. So, yeah. It's quite busy on here today. Everyone's sticking to a cycle path. We've gone off road. We reckoned it'd be a bit quieter here. That's for filming. So, yeah. We'll carry on till we find a nice little spot to sit down and brew up. Catch you later. I think there should be a place somewhere around here where we can stop. Definitely feel a lot more sheltered from the wind at yeah, this point. We cannot feel a little bit of draft, can we? On the other side of the river there there's oh, quite there's, quite some high trees. There's people just over there where I was thinking of going. We can't be doing with people and be talking to a camera. <laughs> so we'll have a little whiz round the place for you look. Nearly went over there. It wouldn't be a Beaulieu Brothers video unless half a, never, half a lover. <laughs> that makes sense. Doesn't matter. Yeah, you hold the stick for a bit. <sighs> Better. Not as easy as I think keeping both of us in shot while you're walking, is it? It's not, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh, there's some stones anyway we could have gone. Some further around. Should we go there? We'll go there, alright. Oh, nose is running. Look at that, nature's left us a nice foul seat. Yeah, a little bit of snow on. Now Lewis. Right then. So a little bit of shade. Here, there's a bit of a, a higher bank, a little bit of, bit of bushes and then yeah, a high bank over the other side, there's not a, a breath of wind around here. Yeah. Still some snow on that landslide area. But this'll do nicely, boy oh. This'll do nicely. Let's get the brews on. Absolutely. Well, so today, I've got me Billy Cam. And it's me, it's my cheap meth burning stove. My drink of choice is a, a toffee nut latte. I haven't filled it before I came. Mine's pretty much the same setup. Got my zebra pot there. Ooh, you can tell which one of us is the driver today. <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, that's some Baileys. I've recycled the bottle there. Um, and I've got a hot chocolate. Not fancy, just one of them Cadbury's ones. And there's my gloves. Oh. 
And there's my cheapy Trangia. It's already uh, filled with fuel. I topped it up after the last time I used it. Oh. Difficult getting into stuff when you're wearing gloves. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Go. My trusty old Cetus Summit mug. Ready? So it's pretty much the same setup. Exact same setup, really, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> so I'm going to do it properly and when I filter some water. I could have easily brought some with us, but I decided not to. So it's the Sawyer Mini. So I've just made a proper schoolboy header. I went to lift the handle up on the billy cam. Burnt my bloody hands. <laughs> Not that bad I live. There are little red marks across my fingers. Mm, donut. That, that's all that's happened. That's all the exciting stuff. We're still waiting for this to boil. Well that's our water boiled now, so time to make brews. Finally, if I had to freeze it, can't wait to grab it. <laughs> So, yeah, coffee nut latte and the seat to summit mug. All oh, the sand in mine, extra flavour. Nice. Warm spilling everywhere. A massive blast of wind before, and it it went as quick as it came. So there's a nice little story. <laughs> I'll show you the froth on this. I think you saw that. Snowflake. Tell you what, it said on the forecast there was going to be a little bit of snow. Yep. Cheers. Cheers, boy. Up. Chin chin. So, the whole idea of this show us your brew is to bring awareness to mental health. And I don't really know what to say on the matter, to be honest with you. I've, um, I don't think I've suffered with ill mental health. I mean, lockdown and all this shit that's going on, and that has been going on for some time, has kind of made me fed up. But everyone's 
feeling the same, I guess. Yeah, everyone's in the same boat. Uh... Well, this is the thing. I disagree with that, Andy. What I'll say is, everyone's in the same storm, but the boats are very different. True. Yeah. I think, because some people, I'm, we are quite fortunate in a way, because we've managed to hold on to jobs. Yeah. There's people in far worse positions than us, so that must be a real toll for them, um, and a mental strain for them, especially if they've got people depending on them, families and all that. This is the snow, mm-hmm. we're getting snow. <laughs> But, yeah, I mean, I, I, I don't know how to give advice on mental health. I'm in no position to do so, really. All I can say is um, be nice. It's nice to be nice. Get out there, do some exercise. Mm. Yeah. Get some fresh air in you. That's, uh, that kind of helps. Yeah, clear the mind. Nice long walk. I mean, yeah, I'm not very good at giving advice on many things, to be fair, because I'm an idiot. Mm. <laughs> but it's nice to be nice, that's all I can say, really. Yeah, don't be a dick. There's enough of them in this world. Doesn't need any more. But yeah, snow, get on. <laughs> Yeah, so, as we said before, Karen tagged us to do this video. So it's our turn to tag other people, I guess. Yeah. So, you're going to tag our friend, aren't you? Yeah. Uh, Paul. A company lad outdoors. outdoors. We tag you to do this video. Yeah. And I'm also going to tag uh, Twin Peaks Wild Camping. I think that's it. Yeah. Simon and Mark. That's your names for the Twin Peaks while camping, sorry. The mind went blank there. So, yeah. So, good luck with that video, guys. I'd like to say a brew tastes better when you're outdoors, but I make it better at home. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta be honest. At least my mug doesn't taste like soap this time. No. Was that your water? I think it is my water, yeah. I'll give it a good wash out. Your water bottle? Yeah. Mm. I can't wait to get out dog well, out camping again. Out in the hammocks. Out in the hammocks. I love my hammock. I've you... got myself a tent now. He's got a tent. I've got the uh, Fox 2, uh, version 2. So, it's just one of the, it's just a budget tent really, but uh, it's meant to be very good quality, well built. Look forward to using it. We'll have to find out when we can get out with it, huh? Mm. Who knows whenever that will be. No doubt I'll be uh, setting it up a couple of times before I actually go out and use it. Nailing it to your floorboards, pegging it out. Yeah, <laughs> just make sure I know how to put it up so yeah. if well, in a storm or whatever, when I'm setting it up, I'm not faffing about getting soaked. Well, I've got a Van Gogh Torridon 200 Trek and I can't seem to find a footprint for it anywhere. So if anyone who sees this video knows where to get one, give me a shout. Because I'm useless at making them. Don't say, oh, I'll just get a bit of tarp and make them. <laughs> I can't do that shit, all right? <laughs> I'm useless at that stuff. Can barely make a tea outside. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> Tell you what, my beard's getting out of control. So is a blooming barn. Look at that. <laughs> Bloody Paul McCartney, eat your heart out. That's not too bad, I bicked it the other day. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna go and shave it off myself, but no, I'm determined to keep the mop till I can get it cut by a proper barber. So. There you are. I'll have it a bit neater and trim shorter than this, but I'm getting into boy or terror today. Well, nothing's interesting happening at the minute, so... We'll bring you back if I burn myself again or if I fall over. Mm. It's me done. Swill. Need a bit of swill? Aye, a bit of swill.
I'll get this crap backed up and back away home. Yeah. Some more footage of the scenery. It might seem it is. It'll just be the same in reverse. Yeah. <laughs> oh come on, focus. So we packed up and we're gonna head off home. I'll show you down here where we were sat by the log. The only trace I've left is footprints. No, you've left a bit of Velcro thing. <gasps> <laughs> good eyes, good eyes. That was not intentional. Right, let's go. Oh, oh you don't look at us. Look over there. Some little duckies over here. Look. Let's see what the zoom's like. was better than I expected. I'm liking this path. It uh, beats trudging through a lot of shite. Well, you're going to get much shite round here now. Not with the temperatures that we've got. Everything's all frozen, rock solid. It's a good job, it's cold. Burning my bloody hand before. <laughs> <laughs> Schoolboy error. Yeah, it happens. Will I learn? Oh, aye. Right. Will you I probably shite? won't know, but. <laughs> it'll, it'll stay in your brain for a day or two and then you'll forget it again. I'll forget. If I had my jack ball, that wouldn't have happened. <laughs> so we're not a million miles away from the car now. We're on the footpath. It's, it's a bit quiet at the minute, so we thought we'd do our little outro and just thanks everyone for watching the video if you did and if you liked it, you know what to do. We can hit that bell button as well if you want to see more of us, get notifications and all that business. Drop a comment, I like to see your comments. Um, I'll answer them. He can't be asked. <laughs> I might have a look a lot later on and uh, use my own profile to message back. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, thanks again. Hope you enjoyed the video. And let's just hope we can have this lockdown come to a bloody end and we can get out in our tents and hammocks again. Can't oh, wait for it. For the <laughs> Yeah. Right. Tatty bye now. See you later.